football fans. Um, I got my Kansas City gear on. Um, yeah, as you can see. Um, so it is time for another football production. So, uh, week three we have the Chiefs and the New York and the New York Jets um, playing tomorrow. Um, both teams coming in at one and one. Um, and I know of the very rough game last week, um, against Houston, um, I do think that we will be better, um, this week, um, and I hate to say this, but it's very unlikely that Jamal Charles will not be playing, um, I mean, they decided that he did not play last week, and they, I mean, I, I, I looked and see, I looked like on a Wednesday or something, and, and they said that he was getting better, but then by like Friday, by like Friday, they said that he's still not 100%, he's almost 100%, um, so, that stinks, um, but, I really think that he could be back next week. Um, I, because if he's not back by next week, um, then that would mean that he will not be back in a year because he had the injury on October 11th, I believe, which was week five of last year. We were at home playing the Bears, um, and he had that, you know, big injury. If you, if you're a Chiefs fan, then you definitely know what I'm talking about. Um, and we're facing Ryan Fitzpatrick, who is a solid quarterback. Um, and if, and if, um, if he did not throw four interceptions in that game in the final regular season game last year against the Bills, I believe, um, he had yeah, four interceptions. They, I believe that they were all in the second half, though. Um, then the Jets probably would have made it in the playoffs, and they they possibly might have had we might have had to play them in the wild card game. Either that, or like Cincinnati or Pittsburgh would be eliminated. Um, but yeah, so anyone, I definitely do think that we will play a lot better in this game and not just get field goals like we did last week. Because that game, I, I honestly couldn't really believe that we all, we only scored field goals. Um, that honestly kind of upset at me. Because, I mean, I, I know that we were a better team than that. Um, and we are we are definitely a better team than that. Um, but we just got to get over that loss. Um, it's all over now. And let's just hope that that doesn't happen again. Um, I mean, we're playing a, you know, a solid team that's been good the past few years, um, and they have a solid defense, um, and I'm just, I'm interested to see how, how well they will play against us, um, um, and I, I, I do think that, you know, we, we will play solid. Solid, and um, we just need to really, um, because I I really just want to win this game. I really do not want to be one and two, um, because that would worry me. Because we got some big games coming up, um, especially next week. Um, so if we don't win this game, I really think that we could definitely lose next week's game, which I'll get to later, but. Yeah. So, what I'm gonna say, we come in and win. And I do think I do think that it will be close. And I actually think a lot of our games this season will actually be close. Um, I do think we'll only have like maybe two blowouts. Um, and I I don't think that they will probably be late in the season. Um, and you know the last two weeks and. Weeks one and two, of course, when we won in overtime against the Chargers and then lost 
which was a close game in 1812 over the Texans. Those are both close games. Um, and both, you know, both those games, we both came out and played hard. And I think that's what we're going to do in this game. So I'm going to say we come out and win it. Uh, 28, 24, it's going to be close. Um, I I don't really think I'll go to overtime like it did when we were at home the last time, but you never know what I think it happened. Um, because these are, you know, two pretty good defensive teams. And, and you know, offense, too. So, um, basically wraps it up. It's a late game. Um, yeah, it's a late game. 3 o'clock, 3 25 start, I believe. Um, at Arrowhead, so, uh, until then.